Yeah, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Huku muda ukizidi kuyoyoma na uchaguzi mkuu kunukia, tume ya uchaguzi nchini IBC kwa kwenye pilka pilka za kujiandaa kusimamia kinyang'anyiro cha mwezi Agosti, licha utendakazi wake kutiliwa shaka na mrengo wa upinzani NASA. IBC kitangaza kuwa kwa njia moja kwa moja imeipa kampuni ya Safran Identity and Security kutoka Ufaransa zabuni ya ununuzi wa teknolojia ya kisasa ya kuwatambua wapiga kura na kupeperusha matokeo kutoka vituo vya kupigia kura kwa gharama ya shilingi bilioni 3.8. This company has been selected for the following reasons. One, the commission has very limited time left to comply with the legal timelines in relation to deployment of ICT ICT in elections which are forthcoming Kampuni hiyo iliyojulikana hapo awali kama Safran Mofo ndio iliyopewa zabuni ya ununuzi wa mitambo ya kuwasajili wapiga kura kielektroniki kabla ya uchaguzi mkuu mwaka 2013 hata hivyo vifaa vya kuwatambua wapiga kura ilivyotoa vilikumbwa na hitilafu na kuilazimu IBC kuwatambua wapiga kura kwa mfumo wa zamani the registration The register preparation Safran is supporting the commission to ensure that we have a credible and reliable biometric voter register to be used in the 2017 general election. So using Safran at this point in time ensures continuity and guarantee for compatibility, time, timely delivery and accountability in the deployment of the new system. IBC siku tatu zilizopita ilikatiza zabuni ya ununuzi wa mtambo huo kwa kampuni ya Jemalto kutoka Afrika Kusini na kudai bei ya shilingi bilioni 5.2 iliyonakiliwa na kampuni hiyo ilipita bajeti ya shilingi bilioni 3.8 iliyotolewa na tume ununuzi wa mtambo huo wa kielektroniki umegubikwa na wingu la utata kisheria taswira inayoweza kuibuka upya na kulemaza maandalizi ya uchaguzi mkuu wa mwezi Agosti reasons have been given and as far as we are concerned that's the only way and the best way out for us to run the August 8th election Kulingana na sheria za uchaguzi zilizopigwa msasa na bunge mtambo huu wa kuwatambua wapiga kura na kupeperusha matokeo kielektroniki unafaa kununuliwa miezi minne kabla ya uchaguzi mkuu na kufanyiwa majaribio siku sitini kabla ya wakenya kuelekea kwenye debe IBC kitarajia kuwa kampuni ya Safran itawasilisha mtambo huo kufikia tarehe kumi mwezi ujao. Francis Gashuri ni Pasha Weekendi.